we all wonder if we're doing a good job as parents. After all, children don't come with an owner's manual. Thankfully, new research suggests that there are important things for parents to keep in mind. What parents do in the early years nurtures emerging character strength that will help their child be successful in school and in life. Here are four ways you can impact your child's awareness and use of her own unique strengths. One, make the good times and help your child focus on the good times. Family life can be tough, but it's necessary to take time to make positive memories with our children. This doesn't necessarily mean extraordinary events or going somewhere costly. It's simply being intentional about spending time and giving your child your full attention. What may feel like an interruption of your day will be the highlight of her day. Follow her lead and allow yourself to be fully absorbed in the moment. Making sure that every day has a few of these simple moments is the best way to build positivity and happiness. Two, see the good, say the good. Give your child the language to understand and talk about her strengths. Young children don't yet have the words to talk about ideas like character strengths. Parents can help build those words and concepts for a child by pointing out an action and telling her about the strengths she used. For example, I saw you share your pony with Andrea. That is really what we mean by being kind. Kindness is a wonderful strength that you have. Three, connect the outside and the inside. Link your child's use of strengths with his inner positive feelings. When you see your child use his core strengths, comment on it and connect the strength use to how it makes him feel. Linking a child's well-doing to their inner sense of well-being helps build that connection in his memory. For example, I saw the way you stuck with that puzzle even though it was hard. I bet you felt proud when you finally finished it. Four, help your child reminisce about her strength use. The more you help your child remember her strength use, the more likely it will become a core belief about herself. Make a bedtime ritual of helping your child reminisce about her strength use that day. It's important to remember with her and not remember for her. For example, when tucking your child in, you might say, remember when Jamal was having a hard time this morning? What happened? What did you say to him? How did it feel to stand up for him? That was very brave of you. I really admire what a good friend you are. So remember when nurturing your child's strengths, make the good, see and say the good, link the good, and remember the good. The character strengths are like our facial features. We all have common features. It is how those features are assembled together. The same features that every person has, but it's the composition of those features that gives each face its unique identity. And it's the unique composition of all of the character strains that gives us each our unique character. Say for example a child comes home and they say that they had trouble sharing their toys during free play and that the teacher was upset with them. And so I might want to talk to them about um, well what did they do to get through that? What happened? What strengths do they think that it took for them to figure out a way to share their toys? So I think that there are ways that you can talk actually real-life circumstances about kids' experiences, I think you can also do it personally.